on this episode of The Impossible Pitch. Meet Luis Silva Marquez, a finance graduate from the University of Cyprus and founder of Tucson, an interactive social studying platform for students and professionals. Luis will meet our four investors and he will have three minutes to pitch his idea and convince the investors in around 400 words to fund his startup. My name is Luis, and I am the founder and CEO of TUSA. So two years ago, while I was studying in Barcelona as an exchange student, um, I was trying to find someone to study with me. But it was hard because most of the people there were not so interested in studying. And as for the rest of the people, I realized that it feels awkward every time that I have to ask someone to study with me. So instead, what I did, I went onto the internet and I tried to find a platform that would allow me to connect with anyone from anywhere in the world at that time to study the discipline that I wanted. And there was no such a platform. So I decided to create one. I teamed up with Thomas Daniel, who is responsible for the technology and programming of TUSAM, and Eliana Theodoro, who is responsible for the graphics and branding of TUSAM, and we created it. And TUSAM is a web-based platform that allows university students from all over the world to connect and study together online by following three simple steps. The first step is that they select the discipline they want to study. The second step, they select one of the available students based on that discipline. And the third step is study. And the study happens on the virtual classroom that contains web camera, chat, and document sharing. So on the 31st of October, we managed to go live, and until today, we have more than 300 users from all over the world, mainly from Latin America, Asia, and Africa. Um, our conversion rate ranges between 4.6 and 8.1%. We have 30% returning visitors, and our acquisition cost ranges between 70 cents and 80 cents. Um, the way we intend to make money is by offering a freemium package that contains ext extras um, that will improve the benefits and the experience of our users. So the educational technology market is huge. It's estimated to be worth uh, $252 billion by 2020. And um, only on Angelis there are more than 500 companies uh, dedicated to educational technology. Tusam's competitive advantage is based on the simplicity we provide to the user experience but also on the fact that nobody else today is doing exactly what we are offering. So our company is raising 200,000 euros, so as to further grow our team and expand to our go-to-market strategy to Latin America. And why Latin America? Because it has a low cost uh, to penetrate digitally. It's one of the markets that has the highest demand for online education, and at the same time is uh, big enough so as to expand and grow there and uh, ex expand beyond Latin America. Yes, thank you very much. So how do these uh, 300 subscribers know you? Um, we're currently uh, advertising through Facebook, which is the cheapest form for advertising for us right now. Mm -hmm. And yes, we are uh, spending $15 a day on okay. Facebook. And what is your advertising strategy for the future, like the next year? Yes, so we, we have made the research and apparently 95 of the students we have surveyed, 125, they use the internet while they study. So mainly will be digitally. Not only Facebook, but uh, also Google Ads and uh, something more, more specific so as to find them whenever they are studying and looking for help. So the, the, the product is finished, it's yes. ready, and you're done with we development. Are live, yes. So what are you going to do with the money? 200,000 is a lot of money just yes. to acquire... Uh, no, so we want to, to grow our team. We want to bring uh, people so as to develop the extras we want to create uh, for the benefits. Yeah. and um, be able to monetize. And at the same time, use uh, some of the money for advertising and marketing and provide this solution to as many people as possible. Um, tell us a little bit more about your revenue model. How are you going to make money? It's, a, it's going to be a subscription or is it going to be per hour? How, how is it going to work? 
So it's, it's, um, it's a freemium model, it's for free. Freemium. So basically, if you want to be part and, and gain from the extras I just described, you have to pay, for example, something between three or four euros. We want to maintain the price low in the beginning uh, because students are uh, by nature yeah, without no income. So um, exactly, but you just pay this fee so as to be able to benefit from, from the extras. So there is a 4.6 to 8.1% conversion with acquisition of 70 cents. 70 cents. Yes. 70 to 80 cents. How does that happen, man? I mean, you have 15 euro per day. Yes. For how long? Uh, since the 31st of October. So, so in two, two months? Yes, average. So we start with five euros. In total, we have spent 300 euros. And right now, for example, we have uh, five minutes ago, we had 334. So you divide the, we, we are dividing the, the cost we are spending for marketing with the users that we have. You know what bothers me, Louis? Yes. Every user is going to cost you about 20 bucks, $20. It's almost $1 now to, to get a user. If 5% of those people actually pay, which is on the high side, the 5%, that means that every user is going to cost you $20. $20, when do they pay it off? To study, it means that you have a three-year lifespan. You have to get him on the first day of the first year he enrolls in university and keep him for three years. It's going to cost you $20 to get him to pay three. Yeah. That's, that's what worries me the most okay. with your business model. And you said it yourself, students are uh, may I, may I reply? usually broke. Yeah, yeah. please. Um, at the moment, we are also accepting professionals. So you can put your uh, normal email, Gmail, Hotmail, and you can register. And because we have done a survey and we know that uh, not, only not only is applicable for university students, apparently we targeted on Facebook professionals, and then we have more professionals than university students. And, and exactly because, for example, someone who does the charter account and the degree, he has an income, uh, but when he goes home at eight, nine, he has to study. So again, this is a great tool for him. You understand that uh, as the conversion rates are low, and as obviously as you add uh, the subscriptions and the fees to the students, it, it will go even uh, lower than that. I understand. So 20,000, when, when do you believe you're going to reach to uh, at the point yes. where you're going to have revenues of uh, we believe that in three years' uh, time we'll be able to be very sufficiently uh, recover that investment and uh, further grow. Um, Louis, it's, 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 it's a good idea. I like the idea and it's definitely in the right market sector because it's growing. I take it's growing a lot. Uh, but for me, I don't believe in the revenue model you're using, freemium, uh, so I'm not going to be investing in you. Yeah, I tend to agree with Marius. Um, I'm not going to invest in you, but I like you, and um, I think that I don't know. There's something about your eyes, but you look your, your determination shows me that you will succeed. If it's not too some, it's the next idea or the day or the idea after. And I'd like I'd love to listen to your ideas in the future, and um, because you look like a, a person that would be nice to work with. So good luck in the future. Listen, I see the value. I think that you have to readjust your strategy. I'm not going to tell you anything about that. You, you, know, you, you know the answer. You will, you will get it, I'm sure. Now you're just testing the water. Uh, the results are not great. We will definitely have to meet when you have something. Yes. Something. Now, now you are. Uh, you are. You... I... Yeah. Honestly. Yes, of course. I don't see. We all been. We all been students. Yeah. I don't really see how this can work 
in a way that would be profitable. Oui, I'm out. But, yes, uh, keep it up. Uh, once you have uh, the subscriptions ongoing, get some rates, come back. Thank you. Thank you. We'll revisit the matter. Yes. Yeah. Okay? Yes. Thank you. Good guy. It's a shame because he's a lovely guy. He, he guy. is a lovely guy. And I, I, I meant what I said, that he, I'm sure he'll do well. But I don't know if it's too soon. Στην MTN οι προσφορές δεν σταματάνε ποτέ. Συνδέσου με MTN 4G Smart και πάρε μέχρι και 50% έκπτωση στο μηνιαίο πάγιο κάθε μήνα για 24 ολόκληρους μήνες. Η MTN σου δίνει πάντα περισσότερα.